Hi guys, welcome to Pabli Connect workshop. So in this video, we will learn how to integrate Stripe and Salesforce. Our use case is pretty simple. When a new customer is created in Stripe, it will create a contact in Salesforce. Now Stripe is an online payment processing platform and Salesforce is a CRM tool. So what we are going to do is, we are going to send the data from Stripe to Salesforce. But there is one minor problem. The integration between Stripe and Salesforce is very limited. In cases like these, we need to bring a third app to connect them both. So in this video, we will use Pabli Connect to integrate Stripe and Salesforce. And the best part of using Pabli Connect is, there is no need for coding skills or programming language. It can be done easily. Let me show you on my screen. Okay, so to begin the process, first type pabli.com in your browser pabli.com press enter okay so this is the website of pabli.com and here you will find an option called as product hover on products and you will find an option called as connect at the bottom you will find an option called as connect click on this then go to this part called as sign in click this Okay, so this is the dashboard of Pabli Connect. As you can see, I already have made an account in Pabli Connect. You can build your own account in just two minutes. Here I would like to mention one more thing that Pabli Connect offers a free plan where this integration can be tried out absolutely free. So if you want, you can create an account just now and set up your own automation. The link is available in the description below. Actually, I will insist that you build this automation with me. It's actually pretty fun. So let's go to this part called as connect. Here click on access now. Now at the right corner you will find a button called as create a workflow. Click this. So a dialog box appears in front of you. This is asking you to give a name to this workflow. I am going to give it as stripe to salesforce and then click on create. So when you click on create, a window appears in front of you. This is called as the trigger window. Here in the choose app, let's make it as stripe. In the choose method, let's make it as new customer. Okay, so new customer is basically a trigger. So your obvious question is, what is a trigger? So trigger is a if statement. It asks a question, if the condition is met, what should be done? For example, if a new customer is created, then what action should be taken by the system? Actually, there are many more triggers like new refund, new order, new coupon, new plan, new invoice item and so on. However, in case if you don't find the trigger of your choice, you can make a request to our team at admin at the rate for the specific trigger that you want to make. So at present, I am interested in keeping it as new customer. So the idea is that whenever a new customer is created, the system will trigger. So what we are trying to do is we are trying to connect Stripe to Pabli Connect. So let me show you my Stripe account. So this is my Stripe account. And since we are interested in integrating Stripe to Pabli Connect, let's go to this part called as developers. Here you will find an option called as webhooks. Click this. Okay, so at the right corner, you will find an option called as add endpoint. Click this. Okay, so here you have a blank called as the endpoint URL. So to get the endpoint URL, just go to Pabli Connect and copy this. This is the endpoint URL or the webhook URL we want and paste it here. But before that, just remove this HTTP part and paste it. Okay, so the description will remain empty. The version will remain same and comes the most important part events to send. So the event is very simple. The event will be when a customer is created in Stripe, it will start sending the data. So the event is customer created. So let's scroll down and find the customer created event coupon credit customer yes we have customer created click this then click on add endpoint okay so it is showing that the status has been enabled so basically it means that we have now connected stripe to pabli connect so let's see whether pabli connect now since it is integrated with stripe can capture any data from stripe so to do that let's go to pabli connect and click on this button called as capture webhook response click this Okay, so it is showing that it is waiting for a data. So let's uh, go and make a response or a data. So we are going to create a dummy customer. So the dummy customer name is Misha Jane. And the account is uh, 
terry roast one two three at the rate gmail dot com something random that's all the description is i love pies okay so the country is uh, she is from let's say france the address line is uh, e105 near park avenues all these are dummy details okay address line 2 is uh, near uh, some park street postal code is uh, 75001 the city is uh, let's say paris the phone number is 9131323918 and the time zone is uh, let's keep it as empty the language is french yeah we have french the currency is let's say swiss franc yeah the tax status is taxable and the tax id is uh, nil then click on add customer okay so it is showing that a person called as uh, what was the name misha has been created and the email address is terryrose123 at the rate gmail.com and this is the description so let's see whether public connect has captured this data or not so let's go to public connect yes the data has been captured so the address city is paris the address country is france and this is the postal code this is the address line one and the address line two so let's see where is the name this is the description this is the email terryrose123 at the rate gmail.com and this is the name called as misha jane so our okay so the data has been captured by public connect so we have to sync this data to salesforce so to do that just click on this plus button so when you click on this plus button another window opens up this is called as the action window here in the choose app let's make it as salesforce this one in the choose method since we want an action let's keep it as create a contact we are interested in creating a contact in salesforce now of course there are many more action types other than create a contact like update a lead create a lead create a campaign and so on however in case if you don't find the action of your choice you can request our team at admin at the rate pabdi.com they will build you a custom action type according to your choice so at present i am interested in creating a contact so let's keep the choose method as create a contact then click on connect with salesforce in new credentials let's click on connect with salesforce okay so public connect is asking access to your salesforce account so before we press on allow let me tell you something uh, public connect doesn't take any chances with your data your data is 100% secure with us okay so just click on allow okay so it is showing that the authorization is successful just click on ok so a series of blanks has appeared in front of you the purpose of this blank is we are going to map in the details that we have received from stripe via public connect for example in the last name since it is required let's uh, map in the name that is misha as you may remember there was uh, no field for the last name in stripe account okay so that is why we are just mapping in the first name since we have already mapped in the name so we are not going to map any more names the salutation in this case is miss okay so other street other city other country we are not going to fill because uh, we are interested in filling the mailing street so let us fill the street that was uh, okay yeah this one mailing city i think it was paris yeah city was paris okay mailing country country was france yes fr for france business phone number business phone number we had phone number okay so this is the phone number email yes we have to mention the email that we have uh, got title department not really important then click on save and send test request okay so it is showing that the data has been sent to salesforce so let's see in our salesforce whether we have a contact of this misha chain yes there is a contact called as misha chain so let's expand this so this is the name miss misha jane and uh, this is the mailing address all the data we have received and this is the phone number and this is the email so the presence of this contact shows that we have connected stripe and salesforce with help of public connect this means anytime a customer is created in stripe it will create a contact in salesforce but to double check it if the integration is working fine or not let's make one more dummy customer in stripe but before that let me show you the whole gist of the process 
So let me minimize this action window and let me minimize this trigger window. Okay, so this is the whole mechanism in a nutshell. First you integrated Stripe to Pabli Connect, then you integrated Pabli Connect to Salesforce. So now there is a perfect flow of data between Stripe and Salesforce. So let's go to our uh, Stripe and let's make one more customer. So this time the name of the customer is let's say Big Ben. The account email is uh, bigben125 at the rate gmail.com. Something random, that's all. Description is uh, Big Ben loves to fight. Okay, so the country, let's uh, keep the country as uh, India. We have India, okay. The address line is uh, G10 near Apsara Talkies. Address line 2 is uh, near Random Street. Street spelling is wrong, sorry. City is uh, Bhopal. Okay. Postal code is uh, 462023. The state is uh, Madhya Pradesh. So 9131323914. Okay. Same as billing details, the shipping details, and then the time zone. Let's keep it as empty. Language, uh, whether we have English. Yes, we have English. Currency is uh, in INR. That would work. Yes. Tax status is taxable. Tax ID, just keep it as empty. Then click on add customer. Okay, so a person called as Big Ben has been created in Stripe and uh, the customer ID, the customer email is uh, bigben125 at the rate gmail.com. So let's see in our contact whether we have a person called as uh, Big Ben. Let's uh, go to contact again. Yes, we have a person called as Big Ben. Yes, uh, this means that our integration is working absolutely fine. So from now onwards, whenever a customer is created in Stripe, it will be reflected in Salesforce. Not just these two apps, you can integrate a plenty of applications using Pabli Connect. If you have any queries, contact us at admin at the rate pabli .com. Our dedicated team members will help you to automate your workflows. Or just visit us at www.pabli.com. It's awesome. Thanks.